This is little Bobby and Jimmy. Let's get a closer look at their brains. All right now, easy, easy, let's open them up. And there you have it, two normal brains. But there is a big difference between Bobby and Jimmy's brain, and it's all to do with how the soil of their minds have been prepared. Your brain is soil. When we understand something, it is made up of all the parts already inside of us. The seed growth of new ideas in your brain is fertilized by the soil of memes already inside your head. There is what you are born with and that which has passed before your senses. And for any new seed growth to occur, for any new concept to take hold, it must be fertilized and given the proper time. Sometimes we don't see the causes that go in, but in they go, and cause they do indeed affect. We don't have a soul, we have soil. So ideas can be seeded, and they will grow. But if you have a lot of toxic waste in your soil, if personal experiences have not nurtured the potency of your fertilizer, then it's possible that the seeds of kindness and empathy and understanding, the very best of what we can be as humans, will never flower in your brain. Rage and anger and hate will be the only weeds to claim the territory of your mind and your more graceful potential intellect will be but a tragic missed opportunity and without question make you more of a blight to sentience. If we are lucky, events and moments and memes may trigger growth in us and prevent us from becoming the worst of imposers. But it all begins with how well our soil has been prepared.